Can we go back? Just keep going. Down, down, not up. Not from the... Can we go back? Bells is gonna blow. I don't wanna see that. For a young person who's coming up, uh, the best thing I can tell them about fame is that you have to really humiliate yourself early on. Uh, make a fool of yourself, and uh, which you probably will anyway, and then you'll see how bad it is when you look at it again, and you'll adjust. You know, Richard uh, Belzer, let me just be frank, uh, he's humorless, he's, uh, he's his own conspiracy, he still thinks he's a stand-up comedian. I'm not sure if you've seen his acting in the last 10 or 12 years. I'd like to repeat that for you now. Keith Richards' aerobic exercise video. <laughs> People always clamor around the bells, a name which, by the way, he made for himself. How many people have cars in New York to drive in New York? New York is so different than any other city for driving. New York cops don't give a shit about driving. You can be driving down the street in New York with a beer between your legs, seatbelt flapping out the door, trying to hang out of your mouth, go through 10 red lights, 60 miles an hour, New York cop will go, give me coffee on the way back. It's different in LA and California, and I was in Beverly Hills a few weeks ago. I got pulled over by a Beverly Hills cop. I said, what is this, officer? He said, your left speaker's up. He has people lying to him how funny he is. Like, he has people telling him that he's stylish. Believe me, he's clueless how to dress. The point is, he's a hoax. He's a big fucking hoax. And I did figure out how Bruce Springsteen got a singing style. Whenever Bruce wants to hit a certain note, he just gooses himself, and that's how he does it. <laughs> Richard Belzer has been a big influence on a, a big generation. Uh, I have avoided his influence like the plague. This is Belzer vision, okay?